Good morning everyone. Um, I'm starting this vlog on a Saturday morning. Um, I've got work today and I am making a skating dress from scratch. So I thought that'd be interesting to film. Um, I started filming it the other day when I started making it but <laughs> I ran into a few uh, complications <laughs> so I stopped filming for it and then I'm gonna start now again because I finished like the whole main like body piece of it and stuff so it looks really good so I think it'd be nice to film like all the rhinestoning and stuff um so yeah I will show you what the dress looks like now actually um these haven't been glued on or anything yet um I'm just like I was just putting on them putting them on just to see what they look like um but yeah I will hopefully hopefully I'll be able to try it on to skate in next week it should be done by the weekend I started it on Wednesday I think yeah, it was Wednesday I started. Um, I finished all sewing it all together yesterday. And then I put on all the, like, motifs and stuff on it yesterday too. Um, and I sewed on some of the bigger, like, rhinestones on it. So, yeah, it's really exciting. I really love it so far. I tried it on and it fits well. The sleeves are a little bit t uh, baggy on the at the top, but I, might, I should be able to fix that anyway. Um, but, yeah, I need to go to the, like, the dance fabric shop after work because... I don't have enough rhinestones <laughs> at all <laughs> so I'm gonna get a whole bunch more of them but I finished work at four and the place closes at five so I'm gonna have to quickly like rush off there um yeah I'm excited hopefully Monday or Tuesday I'll get to skate in it and I'll put some clips in at the end of this video of me skating in it but yeah that's what I'm gonna be up to today I am gonna head off in like 10 minutes to work and oh actually I need to sign up for a test today I'm testing my elementary pattern in a month so yeah I need to sign up for that at 12 o'clock today except I'll be at work so I need to like rush off to the toilet and just sit there and like sign up for it because the test um test sessions only have like 18 or 20 slots in it so you really have to like rush in to book them because they it fills up within like two minutes so yeah that's kind of stressful um I've got the form all filled out and stuff and photocopied but I really hope I have like everything I need on my phone I'm gonna like I have to try and connect to the Wi-Fi at work and stuff just because I don't know if I have enough data so I'm kind of stressed that that's not going to work because there's only one test, test session left after that too so I really want to make sure that I get this one booked just in case I do fail so that I have one session left to like try and pass it if I do fail so yeah stressful but yeah hopefully I get that booked I'll try and film it too <laughs> um but yeah so I guess I will see you then, maybe actually, or when I get to work. Alright, I'm back from work. Um, I tried to book the test session, but I left my card to pay for it in the car. And I thought my phone would like automatically fill in the like my details and stuff, because it normally does for everything else. And it didn't do it today, so I missed it. So now I have to wait until either hopefully another slot opens up for it, or until next month. Which would really suck, because then I'd only have the one shot the like one shot to pass it and I wouldn't get to retry it so that'd kind of suck but yeah work was alright it's kind of long but stressful trying to book that test <laughs> yeah I'm gonna head off to the um the dance fabric shop now so that I can get some more rhinestones then I can sit at home and <laughs> start finally like putting them on they're all hot fix ones so apparently I can iron them on which would be really good so I'm going to test it on some fabric first because I don't really know how to do it yet, but I'll figure it out. So, yeah. Alright, I'm all, all I'm hiding behind the steering wheel. This is the best place I could put my camera. Um, <laughs> but I'm done at the dance place. I got 200 of these. I had The poor lady had to count them out individually because you pay for them like individually. So she's sitting there counting them out until she got to 200, but that's alright. And then I got 50 of like the slightly bigger ones. Um, so yeah gonna be fun to stick on. Yeah, I'm gonna go home now, test out like how to glue them on. I think I should be able to do it with the iron. If that works then I will get started. I also want to make a matching scrunchie too so I think I'm just gonna cut out fabric for a scrun for a scrunchie and then glue the rhinestones onto that so that at least I'm doing something with those ones because that's they're supposed to be super like stuck on there once they're on there so that's good so yeah I'm gonna head off home now okay I'm just gonna test out like a piece of with this piece of scrap fabric what it's like to glue the little rhinestones on um apparently you can just use like another piece of fabric and fold it over and you just need to hold it there for like three minutes yeah 
I'm kind of, I don't know how this fabric's going to go with it. The lady in the fabric shop said that this one is definitely okay with hot fix, but I just am still worried that it's not going to be. <laughs> so I'm just going to give that a shot. I also don't know what temperature to put it on. And it's stuck on there, but this little bit that has gotten like burnt. I think I just held it on there too long in like the middle of the iron. So I think I just need to keep it moving and it'll be all right. But I'm going to test it again because I don't think I even held it for the whole like three minutes or whatever. But yeah, so I guess I just need to be careful. All right, I'm going to try and glue on my first little patch here. Not this bit, just this. <laughs> um, yeah, hopefully this one. Alright, I'm done with my first like one and a half like rows of them. Um, it took a while to get the hang of it because it's kind of, you kind of almost have to do it one by one which is really hard and tedious but yeah I got the hang of it. Um, so this is what it's looking like so far. I've got these ones on. Oops. The camera's been really funny with focusing these ones and these ones and then I'm going to do like a similar thing as I've done here and just like bring it down. Then I'm going to do a few of them up here. So yeah. So it's getting there. It's not looking too bad. Alright, another update on the dress. It's looking pretty good. <clears throat> um, yeah, this is taking so long though. I've been doing this for like, I think I watched like three or four episodes of like 40 minute, long, of like a 40 minute long show. So it's been a while. <laughs> but yeah it's looking really good I'm really happy with it so far um, but yeah I'm gonna keep going I don't know how much longer I'll do it for um, cause yeah my back kinda hurts from standing here and like trying to iron like this <laughs> so yeah I'll call it quit soon but yeah I kinda just wanna get the main like front bit done so that I can try and try it on tomorrow and then if it needs more on the front then I'll do more and then try and get the back done tomorrow if I don't do it today Okay, I'm all finished with the front now, I think. Um, it's taken me like, I think three hours. It's like, what time is it? 9.30 now. I started at like, maybe six at the latest actually. So yeah, maybe three and a half hours and this is much, as much as I got. Um, yeah, I really like how it looks. It's kind of hard to tell when like it's not on and moving, but yeah, hopefully on like a Monday or Tuesday or even tomorrow I can probably try it on. Good morning everyone, it's Sunday morning now. Um, I got up about an hour ago, it's nine o'clock now. Um, I just had a shower, got ready a little bit. Um, I have work again today, only three hours though, so today should be nice and relaxing besides those three hours. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot to show you actually my necklace. My boyfriend got me for my birthday this little like blade necklace. Oh, I don't know if you can see it very well, like that. Yeah, it's really cute, I love it. Um, it's all like silver and stuff, so it should last a really long time. Which is really nice. I love it. Um, I'm just going to chill out for a bit before I go to work. I'm um, probably just going to watch some YouTube. And then go to work. Come back. I finish at 2. So I've got plenty of time today to get started on the dress. Which is exciting. And hopefully I can wear it tomorrow. Because I did try it on yesterday and they did like... Most of them stayed on pretty well. A couple did fall off. But I think it's just because I'm not holding it down long enough. So... Today I'll just like go over them all and just make sure that they're on there properly. So yeah. Alright, I'm back from work now. Um, it went by super quick because it was super super busy today. So that was good. It was also only three hours so it wasn't going to be too long anyway. But I went past Kmart quickly on the way home because I wanted to get a red nail polish that like matches my dress. So I found this. And I got a, like an elbow protective sleeve thing. So I keep falling really hard on it when I go for double loop and it like it really really hurts. <laughs> so I'm gonna get that just for like peace of mind when I go for it at least. So yeah, that's good. Um but yeah, 
I'm at home now. I just made some lunch and I'm gonna sit and relax for a bit before I start doing my dress because it really hurts my back standing up to like ironing <laughs> all the rhinestones on. So yeah, break time for a little bit. All right, I'm back in here again. Um, I've started on my dress again. I tried it on before I started doing this again just so that I could check that I didn't like it and I decided that I did actually like it <laughs> but I just needed a few adjustments so I've just brought them up a little bit higher because when I tried it on the rhinestones were sort of like there would be a gap between like the bottom of the lace and then where the rhinestones were so I'm just adding more in there and I think it should be better like that and then just adding more around the bottom so I'll show you what it looks like so far um yeah I think it's gonna look better so I've just added some like under here and under here so that when I when it's stretched it doesn't leave that gap and I've added more down here I'm still not done yet but yeah I'm gonna keep adding some around the sides here too and then I'll try and try it on a little bit later but I don't want to make them fall off or anything even though I did try it on last night <laughs> um but yeah maybe later tonight I'll try it on I'm not sure but yeah I'm excited to hopefully skate it tomorrow I think I should bring it anyway and just see but yeah exciting I really like how it looks so far <laughs> Okay, I'm all done, and I tried it on, and I probably shouldn't have, but I did it anyway, but I really love it. It looks really good. It looks so much better now that I fixed those bits. On um, the back, I just put like a couple on the back, I'll show you after, but it's nothing super interesting. Now. But yeah, I really, really like it. I'm so excited to skate in it. I, I'm going to bring it tomorrow, and I'll skate in it, and yeah, I'm super excited. All right, I'm all done with my dress now. Um, I'm just sitting down now with a lamington and an ice cream, which is really great. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm just gonna chill out for a bit. The Formula One's on in an hour and a half too, so I'm gonna watch that. Um, yeah, still loving that. <laughs> um, yeah, that should be good. Um, oh yeah, this, you're wondering why there's a mannequin. <laughs> my boyfriend was using it for a media project that he, was doing for uni so we got it at uni and he just hasn't taken it back yet <laughs> so that's just chilling over here yeah um anyway <laughs> i am just gonna relax for a bit and then watch formula one when it's on i'm really excited and then yeah i'm gonna go to bed and then i have a lesson tomorrow morning at eight eight o'clock yep eight um and then i'm gonna skate in the public session and i'm gonna wear my dress i'm so excited um yeah so i will probably chat to you tomorrow morning <clears throat> and I don't think I'll do anything else tonight in dressing so yeah I'll see you tomorrow morning all right it's a little bit later again I know I said I was going to bed but I thought before I go to bed I'll just quickly test um check if there's any spots in the test session thing that I was trying to book yesterday and there was one spot <laughs> one left and I quickly booked it I'm so relieved I was so stressed that I wasn't going to be able to do that and like the chances of me getting a spot the day after of it opening is so small <laughs> so I'm so glad and it wasn't that like an extra spot opened it was just that somebody backed out I think because there was still the same number of like spots available but just like one less opening or something I don't know but oh my god I'm so relieved I'm gonna be I feel like my coach is gonna be really happy too because like <laughs> Just in case I don't pass, I still have the next month. I, like, that is making me so much less stressed. That was stressing me out so hard. I'm so glad that I checked that. Good morning, everyone. It's Monday morning now. Um, I'm just about to head off to skating. It's 6.50. It's so cold outside. I have, like, <laughs> I've been driving to skating in my hoodie just because it's so thick and comfy and warm. But it's, like, 9 degrees outside. I've got like a thermal on, long sleeve shirt, a uh, jumper on underneath this and this and I'm still freezing. So the rink's gonna be so cold. <laughs> but it's alright, as long as I just like warm up with all my like jumpers on, then I get warm enough to go out onto the ice. So yeah, anyway, I'm gonna head off now. I am still so relieved that I got that spot in that test session last night. I'm so glad. <laughs> Yeah, that means I'm probably going to be doing test patterns all morning, <laughs> so yeah. Um, I can't film in the private session, so I'll film in the public session that I go to afterwards.
put my dress on. Got it on. Ladies and gentlemen, Madison experts ready for a double sell. Here we go. Look at that. She did her own dress. She did her own dress. The whole thing, the whole thing including the bling. Look at those bling. Oh, she's been filming. <laughs> so I figured I don't really need to vlog tomorrow um, but yeah I have a competition in like a week and a half next Saturday I'm competing so I should have a competition vlog coming out in like two weeks um, but yeah I hope you enjoy the video and I will see you in the next one